Hey guys, today I just uh, received this little gift from my friend. It's called the uh, Bluetooth scanner, OBD Bluetooth scanner. So uh, this is made by original made by Conway. So the version is uh, Cataru 903. It's a Bluetooth version for uh, for for Android cell phone. So uh, it's pretty amazing for this little box, just like the iPhone cases. So at first. You can see this little box inside here we have a Bluetooth adapter so uh, it's uh, with the uh, on off it's, it's even with the on off switch and also this uh, 16 pin diagnostic port so what else in the box we have uh, oh we have a user menu uh, and a CD for the software I think so inside the user menu, it's uh, just a quick start menu for step-by-step uh, -step guidelines about how to do the connections. So as I already tried it, I would just pass these steps. So at first I need to connect this one with the OBD2 diagnostic port, it's normally under the dashboard. So uh, I have an extension cable connected, this is my extension cable. So uh, I need to plug it with my uh, with this adapter. So I just press the on off button. You see this uh, lights coming on. So I just put it here. So I prepare my Android cell phone. This is the Android cell phone for the. So first we need to con connect with the connect with the adapter. Need to go to the Bluetooth. So need to enable your Bluetooth. Wow, there's so many Bluetooth devices around. And then you see this uh, Conway Bluetooth uh, adapter. So all you need is just type in the password. The password would be uh, 1234. It's quite easy to remember. So you can see it's paired very quickly. And then you can download all this program. This is for what I do the test. So uh, the Torque, the OBD Car Doctor, Dash Command, even the Open Dike. So I will just check on the talk. You open that, and first step, we need to go to the adapter status. Oh, it's all been connected. Ah, maybe it's before because I did the connection already. So uh, if you're first here, you will go to the setting and OBD2 adapter setting, and then choose the Bluetooth device as the Conway. Of course, as this type, you need to choose the Bluetooth one because they still have a Wi-Fi one. This one, the Wi-Fi is compatible with the Android and the iOS, the iPhone version as well. And the Android is uh, Bluetooth. So after you click this one, I, I suggest you guys can connect with the uh, fast communication mode. Like this one, you need to enable, enable it. It will be much more faster, believe me. So uh, after you finish these uh, steps, you will go out and we log in. And you will go to here. So all you need just wait about 10 seconds. Oh, no, it's just 5 seconds. You see all these three green lights. It means the connection is well. So from this software, from this program, what we can do, first we can read the real-time informa information. This is really good and uh, cool stuff. So uh, you will see all this data um, uh, updating in real-time, like this is my dashboard's RPM. So it's uh, just update and synced together very quickly. And also like this, you can add some gauges by long press. You can add the display, or you can uh, check other information like uh, the speed up time. And also, this is good for the emission uh, redness status. So it will show all these uh, subsystems if they are ready for the smoke test. And we have uh, a bunch of data, which is. Uh, 
sensor readings with live sensor readings so all they can support it it will be showing from your vehicle like the intake pressure so uh, you can also add some uh, display in different gauges like uh, meter dido or some so that's a lot of fun for you to use it there's another function for this uh, ERM327 Bluetooth scanner it's a check engine light. If you have a check engine light on your dashboard, so very possibly that you will have a, like a, a sensor failing or any stuff. So all you need is just click in the uh, check engine, the focal reader, and all you need is just uh, type in. So it will start to uh, scan your scan your car computer and give you a result about what's the meaning is so this this might take about uh, a few a few seconds or we can just uh, exit let's say it's still scanning so we guess so uh, it shows there's no focal for my car ECU so of course I have no problem with my car if you have you this uh, option for you to just clear the faults on the ECU or refresh or you can save the fault logs or share with somebody or on the YouTube or Twitter so uh, not other plugins we can get from here is shows the data in the graph mode or you can also modify it after you put the car information you can do some test results and also you can view the maps so that's basically all the things about this uh, scanner I have still another ERM identifier for this adapter so uh, this is to confirm whether it is the true version 1.5 because there's still a lot of fake version or the uh, other version so if you see all this screen it basically mean they support all the obd2 particles for this uh, erm327 1.5 so basically that's all